Um, yeah, I was just kind of curious how, you know, they could still have uh, sin happening after after the millennial reign. I just, I don't no, understand. It won't, it won't no, be it's after. It's not sin. It's, it's sinners who are not allowed into the holy city. Just like 1 Corinthians 6, 9 says, don't you know that the ungodly and the whoremongers and murderers will not inherit the kingdom of God? This is where they do not inherit the kingdom of God. They're not in the city. They're out. Yeah, and 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 uh, and and punished. Uh, yeah, there is there is places. no sin during the uh, New Jerusalem. That is not going to be there. Uh, we have a complete new nature. We have a brand new environment, brand new heaven, brand new earth. Uh, old things pass away. Behold, all things have become new. Uh, this is where where we're going to be forever. Uh, there will be sin, people sinning during the millennial reign of Christ, where Jesus reigns from Jerusalem. But that's why we rule and reign with him, to make sure we don't see the, the world turn into what it is right now. All the politicians taking bribes, everybody's padding their wallets. You know, you, you know you've got all this, this bad stuff going on globally. And uh, that's not going to be the way it is during the millennial reign of Christ. I, I, certainly, I certainly see the, the need for that. Uh, I think everybody does. So, but as far as sin in the New Jerusalem, no, that's outside the walls, and I believe that is a, a, a partial description of the lake of fire outside. This is where they will be, and the Bible goes in more depth, saying they'll be in a lake of fire. So, Virgil, hope that helps. Thank you. 